Hey, welcome back to the channel, guys. Uh, yeah, in today's episode, guys, is the continuation of the episode that I started uh, for the Walmart pressure washer. Again, quote unquote, it's a budget friendly pressure washer system. I'm going to show you guys on this video how well this pressure washer is working. It's fairly inexpensive pressure washer, and I was able to convert it to a setup where I could easily utilize this cheap you can call it cheap uh, pressure washer you know i hate to say it guys but uh it's really sometimes it's all commercialized it's hyped so much that people are, are just basically spending the yin yang uh, on this and you don't even need to to be honest uh there are some really awesome youtubers out there detailing youtubers that i follow that i actually watch quite a bit and uh, they had the simplest things ever and they had millions of followers so anyways guys stay away from the hype Well, folks, uh, it's uh, pretty much bolted in now uh, under this plywood. So uh, what I'll be doing here is that um, I'll be mounting it on the wall here for shortly. It's going to be pretty heavy, so uh, I gotta find a way to. Um, brace it up there technically. I'm gonna show you guys how it looks like from the back here. Let's see if I can lift it up. So it's nice and flush. Well, folks, the idea here is that uh, I'm going to try and uh, mount it up here. Uh, the studs are pretty much right, uh, right around here. So I'm going to find the studs and then basically uh, mount this up um, uh, on the wall and then uh, we can go from there. And when you need to escape from a thousand fires I'm gonna kiss you wherever you are And I'm gonna miss you, I will never die Call me whenever you need someone to be But I'm in the jungle of love Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's pretty much done. Uh, I'll be tidying up uh, a little bit more here uh, early, earlier on, but I'm gonna give it a try, guys. Uh, first of all, I just turned on the water, connected everything. It doesn't seem like there's any leaks anywhere at this point. So, uh, uh, first of all, I'm gonna bleed the water, making sure that the uh, water is flowing. You can, you can see there's, you can see the water is basically, you see all that? That's awesome. So, 
as soon as the uh, the bubble uh, stops or the um, the air pockets there and it's flowing nicely, then we can pretty much start uh, the process here, start the uh, actual uh, machine. So the moment of truth, power this baby up. It ha this has a built-in stop and start, so that's the beauty of this. You know, it's such an inexpensive uh, pressure washer, but yet there's a stop. It starts and stops with it. So nice. All right, guys. Let's see. I guess I gotta use one of this orifice. Uh, let me see. What should I try first? 25, let's try 25. Right. Look at that guys, for a really inexpensive machine, uh, the lag there is pretty, uh, pretty minimal, so... Look at that, for an uh, under $60, $70 machine, 16 years ago, it's really working pretty good. So I got a 25 nozzle uh, degrees on this, uh, let me try 15. Let's put this down. Working so nice, guys. Um, yeah, not bad for uh, under three hundred dollars. Pretty happy so far. Can't wait to start washing the car. That's for sure. <laughs> this one here, I have uh, zero. Yeah, I believe that's zero. No, that's probably what's the black is again. It's just 40, 30. Uh, I think it was 30. No. Let's try the 40 degree. Seems pretty good there. I don't mind the 40 degree at all. Let's try the zero. I think the zero is the one that's a little pointy there. So surprised guys and how this works uh, yeah technically for a pretty inexpensive machine again guys I am just blown away I usually don't need all this fancy crazy expensive uh, products out there and uh, hey look at it I mean it's working just fine so anyways guys stay tuned I'm gonna do some washing here pretty soon and just give it a try and see how it goes I'm try and, and clean the driveway here there's a spot that uh, Needs to be washed, so let's give that a try. Oops. Coming outside, we got a billion races, we got his melody, and you can trust me, baby. We got everything. Call me whenever you feel alone, baby. And when you need to cry, I'll be by your side. Call me whenever you need someone, baby. And when you need to
escape from a thousand fires. I'm gonna kiss you wherever you are, and I'm gonna miss you. Well, anyway, guys, this is not designed for washing the uh, the driveway, but hey, I truly can't wait till I can get the uh, the car out here and start washing. Today I was just lucky enough to get a Chinook and uh, we have a nice weather today. Uh, it's, 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 I think we, we're up to like plus 10, plus 10 degrees for sure. Uh, anyways guys, um, let's, uh, yeah again, I'll, I, I can't wait to try the foam cannon and wash the car and see how this baby works here. Uh, yeah, so anyways guys, I'm just gonna do some tidying up. There's a bit of a leak uh, happening on the reel there. I just need to tighten it up more. So anyways guys, again, stay tuned. A little windy out here, but I'm gonna try and uh, just do some washing on this car here. Let's see how well it does. And when you need to escape from a thousand fires I'm gonna kiss you wherever you are And I'm gonna miss you, I will never lie Call me whenever you need someone to be We're running in the jungle of love The beauty of having a Chinook weather in Calgary, guys, is that, uh, you know, you could definitely do some washing on the car uh, in the process. Uh, with this new setup that I have, I can definitely do some washing of uh, the car, uh, you know, the undercarriage and all that, uh, to get all the salt and, and everything, uh, much like all these grinds that we have on the uh, Jetta here. So. Anyways, let's just give it a wash. Well, not bad for just a quick wash, guys. Um, again, you know, it's just nice to be able to wash a car in the middle of winter in the process here. Of 
very satisfying guys uh, as you can see um, it's just nice to have a nice setup um, yeah pretty happy with that uh, setup that I have uh, I'll definitely be doing more tidying up in the process here I'll probably be painting um, that board that I uh, nailed uh, uh, reinforcement there I'm probably gonna paint that for sure uh, and uh, yeah I'm gonna be putting um, some shelving or even uh, putting one of my um, cabinet on top of this uh, in the process so anyways guys uh, I'll do a bit more tidying here and uh, definitely show you guys uh, how the end result is in, in the process so well, excuse uh, me, guys, because I'm pretty messy here at this point. Uh, I haven't put away any of the tools that I've been using here in the past few days but anyways I want to show you guys what I'm doing here I've been drilling holes on this little bracket here uh, it is a bracket that's uh, used for uh, woodworking uh, like uh, you know building your deck whatsoever and uh, what I'm doing here is I'm, I'm actually trying to find a way to uh, tidy up the uh, uh, the setup here a little bit and uh, what I'm doing here is I've drilled some holes on on this and so I could then put all my uh, nozzles, my tips uh, in here nicely tucked in and organized and uh, you know I just wanted to make it look nice um, in the process so it didn't cost me much uh, this is about four dollars Canadian and uh, I also have uh, where is that thing that I'll be using to um, yeah I have another one that uh, I'll be using to actually hang this uh, this thing over. That's the thing about. Uh, yeah, I can't find things here now because uh, I'm pretty much the. Yeah. Anyways, uh, there is uh, another brace that I uh, that I bought that I could use to hang this uh, in the process. So, yeah, stay tuned, guys. It's coming along. Feel alone, babe And when you need to cry, I'll be by your side Call me whenever you need someone, babe And when you need to escape from a thousand fires I'm gonna kiss you wherever you are And I'm gonna miss you, I will never lie Call me whenever you need someone, babe We're hiding in the jungle of love
Hey folks, it's pretty much done. And as you can see guys, uh, all complete. I was able to um, put together a, a brace for all my nozzles and also for my foam cannon there, nicely tucked in. Also my wand and uh, yeah, it nicely laid out. Uh, my pressure washer sitting at the bottom and uh, I got some lettering up there. Basically it says wash, but uh, not really sure if that's a K or an H, but anyways, we'll, we'll figure it out. Uh, anyways guys, uh, yeah, here it is again, one more time. Fires. I'm gonna kiss you wherever you are And I'm gonna miss you 